Okay, in this video, uh, we're going to show you how to save your work in Pixlr um, so it saves into your Google Drive. So once you get your artwork complete, you're going to, and as you're working on it, you're probably going to want to make sure you continually save your work. Um, when you create your artwork, it will save it into the cloud version of Pixlr, but I always recommend that you save it into your Google Drive to make sure that it doesn't get lost. So once you have your work, you're going to click File and Save. And then I would recommend you save it as a PXD file. Um, the differences are JPEG will take your image and it'll flatten it and basically put all the layers onto one flat image so your layers will no longer be separated. PNG does the same thing. Um, a web will save it as a web doc and it really doesn't work that well. So my recommendation is PXD. This will save it as a Pixlr file. And when you reopen it, it will preserve the layers so you still have all your layers visible. If you're on Chromebook, when you click download, it will say creating your file, download your image is saved to the default folder on your device. Your default folder is actually your download folder. On Chromebook, it will automatically save it into your Google Drive as well. Um, and then if you're on your own computer or your home computer, it probably will not automatically save it. So you'll notice a pop-up on the bottom You'll see here it shows my building example. If I click the up arrow, I want to click show in folder. And you'll see on my computer, it puts it into my download folder. So here's my download folder. And I have uh, the image that uh, the building example for the PXD. So I'm going to want to take this and convert it into my Google Drive. Uh, an easy way to do that is just right click on the image. And I'm going to copy it. I'm going to go to my Google Drive, click in My Drive. Now, some of you may have created a computer graphics folder. Uh, I'm just going to put it in an examples folder that I created. So I'm going to go to my 2020 examples. And I can just right click anywhere inside here as long as I'm not on a file name. And I'm going to click on Paste. And what that'll do is it'll paste that document into my Google Drive. So now I'll be able to open up that file on any computer. I'll also be able to open up Schoology and save it into Schoology as well. Now to find that file again, when you go to File and Open, I'm going to Open Image. If I just navigate into that Google Drive folder, go into my Documents, and here's the folder I saved it. Uh, now I'm just going to click on Building Example and click Open. And it was already open, so that's why I didn't. it actually opened two of them. So it will open up that file and notice now all my layers are preserved. So that is how you should save your document in Pixlr.